Hello again, everybody. Sebastian here with another Watch of Rome's video. Here I am in my Forerunner account. I do have some ancient crystals that I'm actually going to use to summon in this banner that includes Sargak and Gan. Sargak is an excellent marksman. Uh, if you look at his kit, you uh, look at his talent is uh, the, the, the thing that really makes him powerful uh, is that if he inflicts bleed on an enemy, he can then ignore their defense about 50 percent of the defense the other thing that i like about him is with his ultimate he gains attack and not only that with his uh with his uh feral force here he has the immobilized state so he can see see enemies and of course he then he also has specialized attack speed so with his passive triggers his speed increases significantly and all of this makes him a good um, marksman to have in your account Gan is a beast too don't ignore him he's a very good defender he gains three block when you activate his ultimate and he gives allies around him magic and pierce uh, physical damage resistance so he is a good one to have too i have him in my global account i really do enjoy using him and you'd be surprised he actually can hit a little bit aoe damage he does stack his defense up to 30 percent you put him in a good set that uh, has a lot of defense stats with some damage you will see him do uh, significantly well and handle himself so let's summon see if we can get anything and you might be saying you know you should wait for another banner that's fine listen i don't get many non-lords from the ancients here in this account so we'll just see what we can get and if we don't get anything at least we'll be closer to pity for the next banner that shows up which might actually be a better uh, a much better hero than gun and sargak so a lot of blues right now so we were able to get 28 which is actually not bad for this account uh, to accumulate this many ancients uh, it does help uh, to get some chests from Semra. So that's how you pile your ancients. Okay, there's 22. And another Barkley. Another Dagna. Wow. Well, there goes a Lord Pity, but it's on a good hero no question there is no question on that this is actually good i'm gonna show you why i will show you why right so we have I already have Pretius in this account, interestingly enough. So this is going to be an awakening. And um, it's actually going to really boost my account to get him for further awakened. And I will show you this here when, when we're done with the summons. Okay, there we go. We collected we collected the uh, collected the diamonds there. Okay, we still got 19. Let's cross our fingers. Maybe something else comes along. So we'll go ahead and do that. All right, there is your Lucas. Orsa. Ankpa. All right. Ye Come on, Muntan. Ah, Raiden. Come on, Muntan. You can throw a saga at me. Come on, I know you can. Pretius was phenomenal, but let's see if we can throw a Sarga. Ooh, there's Lunaria. Very good. Uh, Corsa. And, no, Autumn. Okay, we got 11 left. And we got Spring. We're getting some diamonds too. We can save those for the future uh, banners that are coming up. With the rare crystals okay there's a boltus we're down to eight and barut there's a nero 
Durodel. We're down to five. Come on, come on. We'll do this one. Aatrox, okay. Now we're getting some epics out of this. There's a Nero. One more. Come on. No, I don't. Okay, this is it. This will do it. Okay, we got another Nero. All right. So, not bad. Hey, we got a Proteus out of 29. That is uh, phenomenal to get. Now, here is my play with this. Here is my play with this. And I'm going to show you why this is a good... It's going to be a good play for me. This is something that I was debating about doing. And I might as well do it now. So, the second Awakening here um, is going to grant me... It's going to grant me attack uh, members get an increase in 5%. But one of the things that makes Proteus so good is when you get to this A3. When the member, when the number of light of judgment reaches five, increases attack by 50%. That is a big boost. Proteus just becomes even more of a monster. When, uh, especially like in Samra or uh, Drake's Castle. One of the things that I was debating on doing, it was actually investing two of the soul stones to get him from A1 to A3. And now that I have summoned him to get him a two, I am actually going to use one of these legendary, uh, legendary soul stones that I do have in this account. So I'm gonna push it to A3 and I'm gonna save the other one in the future. And I'm doing this because the unpolished soul stone was released. So now I can receive those four like the heroes uh, that we uh, that are non lords, right? So the Sargax, they are Diaz and stuff like that. And this are exclusively safe for lords. And to push something like this into this account that is an announcement account, I'm gonna do it. Now, the Semra Apocalypse 2. Hopefully, I get that boost that I've been looking to get there and try to push into 80,000 because that is something that I'm trying to do with this account. And this will help immensely so i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you um, you saw my reasoning and how i use my soul stones especially to push a hero like this one to get him really to pop off and not only boost his faction members but boost himself as well thank you all very much for tuning and watching i will see you all next time Bye.